Hello everyone, I am Dr. Kalpana Suresh, Medical Director and Chief Ophthalmic Surgeon from Kalpana Eye Care Hospital, Chennai. A 45 year old lady came with prominence of both eyes for the past two months. She had redness, irritation of eyes often. Her vision was normal. Examination revealed a high thyroid hormone level in the blood. Our eyes are surrounded by muscles, fat and optic nerve. All these are held in a round bony eye socket. In thyroid eye disease, the amount of fat increases and the muscles thicken. This pushes the globe forwards. It can also stretch the optic nerve if severe. And it can lead to vision loss, corneal ulcers and squinting of eyes. Thyroid eye disease mostly affects 40 to 50 year old females with thyroid disease. However, other people with normal thyroid also can get it. The symptoms include dryness, swollen eyes, frightened look because eyeballs are protruding forwards, inability to close the eye, poor vision, double vision and difficulty in eye movements. So let's see what are the treatment options available for this problem. In early stages, the patients may have to apply eye drops to keep the eyes moist. Take prescribed set of steroid tablets or injections to control the disease. If the eyelids are too swollen to close on their own, they have to be closed temporarily by a procedure. This is to protect the eyes from developing a corneal ulcer. Steroids may cause gastric irritation, weight gain, the puffy face. All these things are reversible once we stop the steroids. They can also interfere with blood sugar levels. For this reason, steroids are prescribed in a low dose as possible. Only a few patients have side effects to that small dose. In them, surgery is advised. If too much fat builds up, the eyes are protruded forwards. They push forwards. This stretches the optic nerve which is the vision nerve and raises the risk of vision loss. After a while, you may also have a hard time in moving the eye. At this stage, surgery is recommended which includes eye muscle surgery and eye socket surgery. Surgery is performed on the bones of the eye socket. This makes space for the eye so that it can be pushed back into the socket. For most patients, surgery is very safe and helps prevent permanent eye damage and vision loss. So if you have thyroid problem, get your eyes tested annually. My patient was advised a short course of steroids. With that, her eye symptoms improved and was advised to take medicines for her thyroid condition. Hope this video answers all the queries about thyroid eye disease. Thank you. Have a wonderful day.